a whim of circumstance. At any time, the smallest flap of a butterfly's wings may set catastrophe in motion. Haran, an entire city wiped from the map. Those left behind there did not stand a chance. The world's greatest minds came together and found a vaccine against the Haran virus. Finally, mankind had prevailed against the disease. But people always want more. Despite a promise to shutter its labs, the GRE continued its research in secrecy for military purposes. It didn't take long for a variant of THV to escape into the world once more. The fall happened more rapidly than anyone could have predicted. The few who survived now live in small enclaves, the only means of contact between distant human settlements. Are lone individuals, brave or desperate enough to travel on their own across dangerous wastelands. They are known as pilgrims. Somewhere on the map, one city is still standing. A city isolated from the outside world. A city with special rules. Now, it's the last bastion of humanity. A chance for us to learn from history. And for once, make the right choices. Because every choice you make here shapes the future. Irreversibly. Everybody, welcome to the newly released Dying Light 2. Now, if you don't remember Dying Light 1 at all, same thing GRE was. Retro was creating a virus, it escaped uh, and decimated Haran, and they were able to quarantine Haran as a city. Um, as you know, I, in the following DLC, got the bad ending where crane turned into um what he never wanted to which was one of the monsters uh the good ending to that was you set off a fucking nuke and blow her on to smithereens um by the way i'm not clicking that it's just going on by itself but um, so it appears that the gre again fucked us and decided to keep going and they fucked everybody instead of just Haran this time um now I don't know obviously I don't know anything I haven't been paying attention to nothing about the game because I want to go in here completely blind now the intro makes me think that possibly there might be some choices you can make whereas in Dying Light I'd say it was pretty linear uh obviously excluding the ending um, for the following. Um, so, we're going to go ahead and start. Uh, that's fine. Mm, yep, that's fine. Register first day the Hussar. I feel the might embedded. Huh. I'll do that. This music is louder than shit, though. Alright. Oh, is that us? 
be cool if we could create our own character. Swap the weapon currently in hand with the one found in the nearby environment. That's fine. Let's turn the music down. I want to hear it, but it's fucking blowing my video content creator. You can avoid this to playing licensed music. Do I care about licensed music? Yeah. And to be fair, I played easy on Dying Light 1 and died a hundred, well not a hundreds, but at least 30 times. So it's not like I can't die. So, but it might be like Far Cry's easy mode to where nothing hurts you. GRE anomalies, your goal is to kill the neighbor. So I might do it like how I did or am doing Far Cry 6 where I do some main missions, do some other stuff, do some main missions, do some other stuff. We'll see how it's set up. 2036. Fifteen years after the fall, which I'm assuming was when everyone got infected. Fifteen years is a long time. Oh, music bumping. No, I'm assuming this is me running for my fucking life. I'm holding my controller in case there's QTE, but... It's kind of loud, not gonna cap. Wow, beautiful game. You still got it. You know, this game used to be more fun. And you used to be younger. I dumber. Same voice actor as Crane. You still just as fast. Because a slow pilgrim yeah, is a, a dead, dead pilgrim. pilgrim. Yeah, I know, I know. Get up here. I want to show you something. So, I wonder... Is... is am, what was Crane's first name? I don't think it was Aiden. Climb up to the ledge. Well, I'm, I auto-run. Oh, triangle turns me around. Square, or... Well, that's how I... Now, it did take me a little bit with the Dying Lights parkour system, so R1 to jump? Oh yeah, they did have that kind of weird button combination, didn't they? Look at a ledge, toward, and jump. Yep, that's how it was with... Hold R1 to jump further, okay. Well, why wouldn't I just do that every time? Shit, man. You're still Oh. Beautiful game. Thank you, sir. Thanks. It's good to see you, Spike. I mean, how long has it been? Far too long. But don't get all mushy on me now. Come. I want to show you something. Where are we going? You'll see. It's incredible. What's incredible? Most pilgrims don't last two, three years on the road. How you've been kicking around for what? Four years now? And you're still alive. So are you. Whoa. I know. But I'm fucking awesome. I'm s I got stuck. <laughs> this is a new game, everyone yeah, keep right, in mind, man. so. Seriously. I wish I had as much energy as you. Got a new lead on Jane? Nah, trail went cold after New Paris. Which route did you take? Through Baines or Gary? Eh, Baines. What a shithole. Some five rickety huts left and a ramshackle fence. Nobody there had heard of her. So she must have gone to Gary. In that case, I'll head north. Now first head east, then think about going north. Sounds like we're looking for someone named Jane. Uh, look at that. 
A beehive full of honey. Can't let an opportunity like this go to waste. Uh, no oh. way. Oh, look around. If we're lucky, there's chamomile growing here too. Fuck is chamomile? Oh, it has like a uh, uh, it's like dead dead sec or dead or watchdogs. Where to pick it up? Oh, here it is. Plenty of it up here. So, am I Crane or am I someone else? Apparently, I've been doing this for four years, though, so pretty good at what I do. Oh, I only had to grab two chamomile. What's wrong? You look like you're doing this for the first time. How about you kiss my ass? You've gotten a bit dull since the last time we saw each other, huh? Back to work. Yeah, this will do. Do you remember that old herbalist we helped escort to her village? Oh yeah, the one that had that saying. Uh, remember, chamomile and honey are gifts that keep giving. Combine them and lucky you. You just might go on living. Okay, I got the blue medicine, which you received. Press big button. You received your first blueprint. Blueprints are plans that let you create accessories, consumables, and weapon modifications using various craft parts scavenged while doing exploration, like the last game. This is where you store all of your craft parts you collect. Read the craft part description, see how they're used, and where you can find them. Roof growth. Medicine boosters. Roof groves. Now hover over the medicine blueprint and hold the craft it. Okay, I got a trophy for that. Oh, here's what. Okay, so we're not going to create a character. That's fine. I'm this dude. And apparently I'm going to get different armor as I progress through the game. Got my medicine. And I got three chamomile sitting in my backpack. As I was escaping from an infected on an abandoned highway, I met a fellow pilgrim. Okay. So. Okay, so I was just, ch I was just running away. And then when I jumped it, I found him. Just doing his thing. And then hints. Oh, this just tells me. Okay. Good. So I just met him randomly. I didn't Come even. On. We almost there. Wait, that's not what you wanted to show me? What did you want to show me? As you can see, we have a quick uh, thing in the bottom left. What is this? This is it. Come on. So how? Wow. <laughs> Somebody had a nice crib. Yeah, they did. Or the keyboard did. I thought they're alive. Damn it! Locked. I'll try to get through here. You check the other side. Take anything we could use. Yeah, sure. He has the same voice actor as Crane, I believe, though. Oh, peekaboo. Circle to crouch. I figured that out. Ooh, what's that? No. Anything in there? Anything in here? Uh... I'm not seeing nothing in here. Let's keep her going. Does that have a doorknob? Ooh. Got some cigs. Oh, first aid. Empty. Nah. Damn it. Hold R3. Oh wow, look at all the stuff I can search. It's just like the other game. Soap. 
That's something sellable, I think. Oh. Five years later, who remembers Haran? Is there any hope left for the thou- There's still people in Haran? Or are we in Haran? Wait, oh, that was 2020. Never mind. That was when Haran was going on. I, I thought it was, I, th I thought it was still, but obviously Aiden blew it up. Or, in my case, turned into a monster and everyone at that camp obviously died. Um, because I was the only one that was going to get them the disinfectant shit. What the? Oh, rats. Yeah, rats. Just rats. How'd you get in? I think it's time we parted ways. Why? I'm starting to worry about you. And you know what I'm saying. If you're starting to worry about someone, it means it's time to go. You need to get the finish your sentence. Probably in the glitch. What the fuck? Why are you worried about me, dude? I got scared by a vase. Whatever. Close that behind me. I got scared by a vase. Why is he acting like I... Like, I tried to bite him. Like, what the fuck? Uh, resin. Uh, rice. Uh, fridge. Nothing, Nothing in here. Rags. Party. Uh, but by then the GRE would have long since lost control of the virus. Dance like it's the end of the world, ironic. Was that me? Spike, I thought you dipped. Oh! There he is. Man, you're such a poser, dude. You said you were gonna dip and you didn't. I wonder how the wine tasted back then. Not a uh, investigate records. Voodoo, you voodoo. Hmm. Sounds familiar. Uh, that's a that's a that's a call back to uh, Dead Island. I never I played like a little bit of that game, but I never uh, never got into it. I don't know if they- and that's what they called art? Hey. But I don't know if they- did they create Dead Island? I see some of the search over here. Scraps. Hide area? I can hi you hi oh there's hiding mechanics that <laughs> I don't like that that means that it's all not all fighting which is not good I guess you can have the choice Better of fight zip I guess there's a choice maybe uh, okay we can open this door holy shit uh, wow Apparently they did party. That gets the end of the world. Wow. Sorry, Dave. Goodbye. Rest in peace, buddy. That's heartbreaking. Mm, I'd say so. Rest in peace, buddy. Party to celebrate the end of the world. They died on their own terms. Mm -hmm. Let's hope we get that lucky too. I thought you were gonna. I'll see what's upstairs. You check out the garden, okay? Okay. I thought you were gonna dip. I thought you were worried about me, bro. Nothing to search. Besides these over here to investigation. Wow, they like did like a cult thing where they all went on their own terms.
They look like a nice couple. Rest in peace. At least they had each other. Yeah, that's true. They did like a cult thing where they all died. They all killed each other, or they all killed themselves. She was classy. Metatosis. But how do you... They must have... I don't know. I mean, look, this guy just died being the DJ, you know what I mean? Like, what did they do? Look how many there are, though. Holy shit. What does that say? Is he gonna read it? Dearest Mary, yep. I'm sorry I ran from you. They say that once the virus makes you turn, you're gone forever. That can't be true. I know you're still in there, underneath all that pain and disease. I'm coming to join you. No more running. God. Hey, come here. Check this out. Dude, there it, it is a literal deathbed over here, bro. It's sad as fuck. End of the world party. It's really sad. All right, I'm coming. I think the stairs are over here. Because this is the direction he went in. Oh, a lot of shit to search. Get plenty of stuffs. Anything else? Nope. Nothing. Clear, clear. Alright, I'm coming. Can I jump up on a ledge somewhere? I think. Hmm. Yep, here it is. I knew there was a ledge somewhere. They had a... I'm just gonna... I was about to say, they have their own entire commercial unit for their AC, but it don't matter now. What do you got? Sit down, buddy. For you. A gift? A gift from the heavens, to be more accurate. I've just found it by the owner's dead body. May it be of more use to you. Appreciate that. Here. It's gone flat. <laughs> Look at you and your sophisticated palate. Drink. Who would have thought the end of the world could be so peaceful? Yeah, at least until night falls. True. I wish Crane could have seen this. Wh who? Doesn't matter. Matters to me. What do you mean, Crane? Obviously, we're not Crane then if he's dead. Which sucks. But. I tracked down that guy for you. How did you know who Crane was? Uh, oh, I can... What guy? Why didn't you say so earlier? What guy? Hey, what, what, what guy? Quit pretending. You became a pilgrim to track that fucker down. Waltz, I found someone who knows him. <sighs> Why didn't you say so earlier? Hey, what? And you're only telling me now? <laughs> when I tossed you a beer, thought you'd guess right away we were celebrating. So some guy named Waltz. The guy's in Villador. Supposedly he knows something about Waltz. Villador. I saw him that close, huh? Hey, I got a favor to ask you. You deliver this to Gary, it's on your way. People don't like pilgrims there, but, but they pay well. <laughs> and where do people like pilgrims? Well, they're afraid of us. Everyone does their best to survive. <laughs> Maybe. Boom, something needs to be transported through the hordes of infected. And suddenly, they're knocking on our doors. Hmm. All right. But you owe me one. Deal. Uh, not just one. 
So what about that guy? Well, I talked to him over the radio. He didn't tell me his name. Sounds like he's got something to hide. No doubt. See that antenna on the hill? That'll help you contact the informant. He'll be listening for you at dawn on a frequency of 140.200 megahertz. 140.200, alright. What does he want in return? What does he want in return? Didn't say. But he didn't sound like the kind of guy who does things for free. No one does anything <laughs> for free. that kind of guy exists. Exactly. What? What about me? You're an old fart who likes racing me and makes me ask around about his crazy girlfriend. Hey, hey, hey. She's not crazy. Jane's just maybe, well, a little hot-headed. And she's always getting herself into trouble. But if you could get a load of her... <laughs> Whoa, all right. Still too early in the evening for that sort of talk. <laughs> I was going to say eyes. Beautiful. Steely. Huge. Never heard anyone get so worked up about gray eyes. Because you don't know shit about the world, let alone women. Ouch. You're probably right. I'm telling you, I'll finally find Jane. We'll set up a house. We're going to live there. No one's going to drive us out. And I'll stop wondering like a moron. I'll drink to that. And that waltz. What's his deal? Is he family? No. Not at all. <laughs> then why are you looking for him? Will you tell me sometime? Yeah. Yeah, one day. Well... <sighs> Revenge, it's obviously for revenge. We'll see again, huh? In another two years? Maybe. Take care, man. I hope you find that waltz guy. Or whoever you're looking for. And remember. 14200, I remembered. Megahertz. At dawn, the guy's waiting for you. I'll head there now. I ain't got nothing else. Oh, I got a grubby bat. Nothing else to search, huh? Not even this? Alright. Oh, that's a stereo. I'm gonna read hard. Alright, we outie. Hold to an extended hub. Okay. How? Okay. Now, which is my question. Hey! I bet I can get some goodies at that house. Can I put it away? Huh, maybe it goes away by itself. I bet you I can get some goodies at that house. We'll stop by that house before we go to 14200, the megahertz. Oh, gimme, gimme, gimme. Uh, should I try it? Fuck it. Yes. R1 to surface. And circle is to dive. Okay, cool. Oops. I'm assuming top left is my health. Alright, so let's do a little bit of exploring before we head out. Unless someone lives here. Ooh! Are you, are you biters. Mmm. Uh, uh. Bitch. Scaring me. Wow, you didn't have it. You want some, huh? You want some of this? Oh, 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 oh! Give me that cheese. Oh, you broke bitch. Oh. Don't ask me why that scared me, okay? Do I have a flashlight? Let me close that behind me. Oh, stuff. Oh, it's an enemy. Outside wandering around. Come on in, buddy.
Why are you smoking? Are you smoking a cigarette? Oh, 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 I'll show you for smoking. Mm. Oh, there's multiple beehives out here. All right, we can head out. All right, let's get it. What's up? Mm, 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 mm. Nothing. Oh, I gotta climb the bus. Oh, I see how. Look at a ledge and jump toward it to press... Oh, okay. Okay. It's kind of like the, uh... Okay. Can I? Ooh, can I grab that? No. The only thing I'm having issue with this game right now is oh no 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 is discerning what's grabbable and what isn't. Like they don't really make it obvious, but obviously as you go through the game, use L. Well, I don't, I'm not on the ledge. Why can't I not grab that? Oh, there we go. There we go. I got it. All right, we out. A little, the climbing still a little confusing to me, but I'll learn it. Don't get close to biters, or they'll wake up. Holy God, they just, they just stop moving if nothing's nearby. See you guys. So, you pretty much have to hold R1 whenever you do anything. Forest retention area. Please do not disturb the wildlife. I wonder if the wildlife can get infected in this game. The stamina depletes so quickly when you're climbing ladders. Holy shit. So it looks... M oh, no. Oh! I got it. Got it. Got it. It looks like it's more focused on parkour this time around than having worrying about sprinting stamina. Jump out a zipline with R1 to slide down it. Okay, I don't have to hold that, I just press. Gotta remember that. Cause don't worry, I'll jump off a zipline like, every couple of times. Oh, well, that's water. 
Zoop. Hey, buddy. Press L1 and R2. Watcha! Get out of here! Jump with R1 to grab it. Okay. Oh, I got a parkour level up. Oh, we have skills. You leveled up your parkour proficiency and earn your first parkour skill point. Use it now. Use it to now. Use it to unlock your first parkour skill. High jump allows you to jump to high ledges. Hover over the skill icon to read the description and check its requirements. Allows you to jump higher and reach higher ledges. Okay. Reduces fall damage and keeps your momentum. Press circle. Make the last climb on ledges. Even when your stamina is gone and briefly maintain your grip when you land on ledges from great heights. And then we have combat. Jump over staggered enemies and follow up with a kick. Interesting. Eighteen damage. Wonder who could have left it. Huh. So there's variables and I got some consumable stuff. Alrighty. Oh, and here's where I need. There? Ooh, I almost fell. I I have to remember to hold R1. That's definitely a thing that's gonna. Okay, that's a definitely a thing that is gonna have to be punched into my brain. Is the holding of R1 lets you get higher and higher. It's 14200 megahertz. Oh, it's already dark. It's time to hide somewhere for the night. It won't get any better than this. Find a safe place to sleep. If my stamina is depleted, it just throws me off whatever I'm doing. Oh no. station should be here somewhere. Oh. A common machete, huh? <sighs> Saw this. Ooh, what's that? Oh, that's a light I can jump. Oh, no, this. Oh, we got food. We got some stuff. Okay, those are outs. We have footprints. A couple of searchables. Locked. Good. We have footprints. Someone moved them. Not long ago. Okay, let's give it a try. Someone's behind this. <laughs> Or hiding. I don't see anything. All right. This is it. The broadcast station. I gotta start the generator. Wait. Uh, broken shovel. I'll take that. Uh, 
Ow. Oh man, use them muscles, bro. I mean, I'm not really that scared right now. I got weapons. As long as they're just normal zombies. That is not what a normal zombie. The fuck is that, bruh? What is she doing? What the fuck? It's like a witch from Left 4 Dead! Oh, no, nah, we ain't. Some enemy use power attacks that can deal massive damage. When an enemy is about to use a power attack, his health dodge to perform a dodge while moving back or to. Okay, so. So when it flashes red. Out the way, out the way, out the way. Oh! Come here! Yeah, you better win. Yeah, yeah, you don't like a fucking baseball bat to the head, huh? Give me that fucking. I got some jewelry. You want some, huh? Mmm, mmm, mmm. Yeah. Why are you all smoking? Why do they do that? Why do they smoke? Bop. Search real quick. She's like a witch from Left 4 Dead. That was fucking weird. It's hard though when you're being attacked by a a, a swarm and then you have to keep an eye on her because obviously uh, you obviously have to dodge when she power attacks you. So that's definitely an interesting addition. Soup. Start this bitch up. Come on, baby. Oh, three poles. Nice. Oh, take that. I I can always sell them. Uh, if I don't want to use them. Let's get the fuck out of here. At least they opened the door for me. And opened some searchable stuff. Can I close? Yeah, I'm gonna close that. Who installs a deadbolt to door? Can I turn that off? No? Alright, that's fine. You just unlock the first safe zone, increasing your ne network of respawn points. All safe zones are equipped with UV light, just like in the... I almost said dead space. <laughs> All the safe zones have are equipped, which guarantees safety at night. An additional offers resting place where you can change an Aiden stash. So nothing does better than an 18 damage. This is the gangrene. This is slashing. This is, uh, this is, so that's fine. I mean, that does 13 damage. Like, what am I going to do with that? You know what I mean? What does this do? Oh, cool. I have the, oh, there's the. How much is, oh, 24. I'm definitely putting that. We can put. The gang. Eh, let's keep that. Let's put this away. Um. So. Hey, where's my weapon? Oh. Proof of victory over rare infected. Got all this.
Where is my weapon though? Did I, did I not take it out? No, it's in my inventory. Huh, maybe I, oh, may, I'm not, maybe I'm not allowed to use it yet. Oh no, there it is. No, actually my number one will be that. And then there, there. And then there. All right. How do I... Drop, modify... Oh, there you go. It's equipped. Hey, let's roll. One forty two hundred. Yep. Uh, this is Aiden. Over. Anyone there looking for a pilgrim? Over. Oh, he said dusk, or I mean dawn. Yeah, he said till morning. All right, enough of that. Time to sleep. I'll try again in the morning. Yeah, he said at dawn. You can't use weapons. See, but oh, okay. If I click my right stick, I can change what weapon. Okay, and then okay. And then this is okay. 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 I get it now. Okay. I get it. So I do have quite a few scroll wheels um to I don't know what the accessories do just yet though. Alrighty guy. Uh like now? No, we're not old. No, eighty. We need supplies. Everything's ready. I'll end it after this cutscene. Where is everyone? Maybe they're all dead. I'll say that. <laughs> You're stupid. Let's go. Now. Is that my sister or a friend? Seems we're in some kind of medical center. Hopefully, Shh. it'll be all right. Hopefully, it's not the GRE. I'll end it after this up. This cutscene. When we wake up in the morning. It's obviously some medical facility. Horribly run down, but still a medical facility. There's a bunch of bald kids, which doesn't fare well. Maybe an orphanage? Wait here. Nothing good will come of this. Have you brought twelve, three, four, six? That's Walt. We're supposed to take the patients back to the city. Don't worry, they'll let us go soon. Baby, I'm scared. I'm here with you. You're safe with me. I know. So Waltz was the doctor or leader. He doesn't know which one is which. Easy. See, sis. Oh, that is my sister. Even if they separate us, this is how we'll always find each other. Just like all the other kids. So obviously it's some kind of fucked up medical center and Walt was the head doctor. Fire! Fire in the lab! 
And then someone set a fire in the lab. Huh. So I must have lost my sister in the hospital fire, or lab fire. And then Walt was obviously the head doctor there, whatever fucked up thing he was running. So like I said, uh, next episode. Yeah, time to contact the guy Spike was talking about. Alright, yep, next episode. Alright guys, I'll catch you all in the next episode.